This is an SG42MV, and it's actually one of my favorite guitars. If I were to own a Dreadnought, um, I'm not really a Dreadnought player, but if I were to own a Dreadnought player, this one would probably be very high up on my personal list. Why? Well, I'm a fingerstyle player, um, so I like to have a guitar that's really light, open, and airy. And um, we'll get to that in a minute. First, I'm going to put this guitar up on my shelf, video it for you, show it off, and then I will come back and describe it a bit, noodle a bit with this flat pick, and then I will do my standard demo. And I thank you for watching. All right, let me show you this lovely mahogany guitar from Boucher. Headstock with the ebony onlay, the open gear tuners. Now this has the vintage pack, so it is an SG model, but it's got the traditional headstock there. And the uh, fingerboard is ebony. Come on over here. You can see the herringbone inlay. And this has the koa binding. And this is a master grade Adirondack top that is torrified. And get a glimpse of that just how beautiful that is wow that's perfection get a glimpse of the end graft here which is also done up with koa let's turn it around and have a look at the back here we have the back of the headstock the goto open gear nickel tanners the neck is mahogany and it is stained lightly to match the color of Mahogany, you got a center strip here with koa. Look at that beautiful mahogany. Wow. Just lovely. Come on over here. Have a look at the end graph again. The other side. So, just a lovely, lovely guitar. Well, all right, as I said, uh, this particular dreadnought is one of my favorites. Uh, the mahogany uh, is just such an open and airy and extremely light wood and I love, I'm a sucker for light guitars. Uh, light guitars tend to radiate sound from all over when you touch the back you know you can actually feel the back working along and generating part of the tone, more of the tone of the guitar than say the really heavier Madagascar rosewoods or, or even Indian rosewood for that matter. Uh, so you get this warm bass. I'm going to flat pick here with that pick I, I mentioned, the prime tone. You can kind of hear the sparkle and warmth at the same time. play that all night. Um, let me do my standard demo. I thank you again for watching. Cheers everyone. <laughs>
Yes, indeed. So, so lovely. Take care, everyone.